Thousands of families flocked downtown for the 91st annual Tulsa Christmas Parade. Two Works For You was proud to see all of your smiling faces downtown. Reporter Lorreen Callender spoke with families along the route with a tradition that's still going strong. Not quite dashing through the snow, but thousands of people filled downtown with holiday spirit as they watched floats designed as classic holiday stories roll through the streets. Every year we come down for the Christmas parade and I wanted to make sure that they start their tradition so I bring them as well. Dozens of floats weave through, each self-propelled with a driver inside instead of outside in a truck, bringing back the older feel of the parades back in the 70s and 80s. And speaking of the old days, the start time was pushed up during the day, which got mixed reviews from the crowd. I wasn't very pleased with it starting it in the day. We like to see at nighttime, it brings that ambiance, you know, but whatever time they present it is when we'll be here. So you can see stuff way better, especially when it's not raining. Organizers hoped pushing the parade time earlier would drive up attendance and make it easier for families. <laughs> Tulsa police officers scanned the crowd on higher buildings, making sure the only thing families had to worry about was deciding their favorite part about the parade. I'm really into sports cars. Yeah, like uh, Porsches and Ferraris. Well, my favorite part is seeing all the different people participating and everybody enjoying themselves. It brings about hope. And of course, the jolly old Saint Nick made a special appearance here in Tulsa, wrapping up this year's Christmas parade. We really enjoy the Christmas parade, and if you didn't get to make it this year, try to make it next year. This Christmas tradition has been rolling through Tulsa since 1926. In Tulsa, Lauren Callender, Two Works For You.